Hello. Oh, wait. Let's have a look at you, shall we? Oh, hold up. Let me change my gear. Nice and clean. Whoa. Wait, there's someone actually there. Look. Tip-top shape, aren't you? You were so pleased you survived the garden district. What the freak? One minute, 37 seconds later. All right, guys. I kind of just went for it. Oh, my God. There are so many. Come on, get in, get in. So what is going on guys? This is Ryan here and welcome back to We Happy Few where <laughs> It's about Arthur guys. He's gone. If you guys happened to miss the last episode. <laughs> freak are you doing here? We finally managed to make it back through the broadcast tower, or more specifically underneath. We entered the train station and we found the bridge out, guys. That is going to be the last we ever see of Arthur. And honestly, it's kind of sad because he was such a memorable character for me. I just enjoyed who he was. However, if you happen to think it was over there, think again. That was only act one of the game, guys. This game is comprised of three separate ones. We've got Hello. Arthur's, then we've got Sally's, Hello. and I think Ollie's okay. to finish it off. So that means right now, guys, we have to enter the story of Sally Boyle. And I am very interested to experience this one. And I kind of have a little bit already. Once you get act two and the way the save point works, I had to keep recording from that point on. So you're going to be seeing a preview yourself and then we'll pop back to myself right now and i'll see we go ahead and get this started guys so if you are hyped do we have to start this all over again so here we go guys we find ourselves at the screen where we're about to start the story with sally press space to continue let's go ahead and do this man i am kind of excited for this one i'm gonna be real sally's story seems very very interesting so here we are in the lab fixing those things add three c scenes all right and there you go well, let's just fire this up. Seems reasonable. Uh, Please don't blow up in the next 30 seconds. Maybe you should turn the fire off if you're going to answer a door. Like, you don't know who's trying to sell you what in this place. Let's go ahead and swipe the key card. Who might just that a be? Minute. Persistence is one word to describe this man or woman at the door. The freak might this... And I'm also, out of Blackberry Spud. Very angry. Come back later. I need it now. Sorry. I don't have any now. Sally, are you some kind of, like, drug dealer? Right now. Is that man at the door? I think I have some kind of fidgeting. Okay, I'm gonna go back. Uh, give me a compliment though. Oh, change mode. Hold up. Off. Okay, let me turn you back on. When they made you, they broke the mode. Still with that insult then. That's no compliment. Anyway, guys, back into the office we go. Let's get this done. Uh, what the hell was that? That's a dude. Oh my god, is he throwing like trash cans at my door? He's breaking in. Are you kidding? Where is it? Where's the Blackberry? I'm what making it. Supplying? You're lying. It's a very delicate reaction. You're saving it all for the bobbies. <laughs> what is this Blackberry stuff, man? Hmm. There's no joy. That's called like Blackberry something. Bro, you're going to blow yourself up if you go gulping down those different things in the test tubes. And he's going to do it. That's a bad thing to do. It's up there, isn't it? That's my freaking house. What are you hiding up there, huh? We only saw the entrance. The emergency kit. The emergency kit. Okay, whereabouts is that? We got a blower. Guess that's no, uh, nothing of importance, I guess. Emergency defense kit. This All right. better work on spot. Sally uses knockout syringes to sneakily knock people out. It is so much more modern. Yeah, you don't see? So we even know the guys. Oh. Oh. Here I'm upstairs. Okay, we've got to get close. There's a lot more kind of suspect. Oh, no. Wait, I'll search that. There you go. Uh, where is he gone? Not in the bathroom, at least I don't think so. Window is jammed. He's gone straight upstairs. Hey, Spud! The freak back down here, man! She broke my brain. It's not possible. Huh? We sent them all away. They never came back. There's a kid. <gasps> it's a rat. I'm hallucinating. No, you dare. Uh, it's a rat. Bro, you're and done. It's gonna bite me. No. It's sedated. You can't be a baby. Use it. You're a rat. You have to be a rat. Well then, you can go back to bed, poor little soul. Whoa. We better get Spud out of here. Hey, there you go. What the? This is like. I am so fascinated with this so far. Sally got that baby upstairs? Like, what You'd the freak? You'd think a junkie would weigh a bit less, wouldn't you? I see some kind of, like, fat slob. Why do we have a portrait of ourselves with a big old red circle round? All right, let's take Spud downstairs anyway. Gotta get rid of this guy. Oh, and the blower. Of course, there's the blower. It's optional. Hmm. Will that change anything? I kind of want to answer it nonetheless. That thing is ringing right now, guys. Hold up a sec. Let's go ahead. Uh, wait, how do we answer this thing? I think we have to put him down. So, yeah, we'll place it there. Let's have the message anyway. So, we'll place that thing. Oh, got it right there. Brilliant. 
They all want Blackberry Joy. What? It's a new strain? Spock couldn't have shown up at a worse time. Okay, we'll take a read of that in just a sec. Blackberry Joy, you say, though? Interesting. Right, let's open this. Okay. No creepy doctor around here. Uh, That's still boarded up. So we're going to find out why that thing, I guess, got broken down eventually. All these small things. Uh, yeah. I you belong in the trash. Right? True. So Gwen's upstairs. I kind of calmed her before. I guess we're going to do it one more time. You know what? Let's go ahead and lock the door. We've got to be safe here. Get right. a bucket. What the freak is going on? This is chaos, man. Uh, can we check on the baby all the same? Let me see. Uh, She's all right. There so, you go. Easy to sleep. He won't bother you anymore. Sure. There you go. Okay. Baby happy sounds. Hey, that's how you know you're doing good. Oh, Let's do it, man. You've got a poopy oh. nappy, don't you? Oh, boy. Uh, Let's go get you a nice clean one. Now, I'm not sure. some water. I'm into this. This is, uh... I'm down to take care of a baby right now. What's wrong with your lab? Yeah, we got things going off like everywhere. Uh, okay, so filter the water requires tap water. Uh, that's drinking from it, so fill the canteen with the. I need a canteen, it's right there. There you go. Can't have that joy infested water going near the baby. And then we're gonna go ahead and filter the water. So whilst that's doing that, let me see what's popping off with the lab. I shouldn't have left it alone. Uh, okay, I'm gonna reduce. Turn down the heat. Oh! That thing's gonna explode otherwise, so that's that one done. This one as well, looking white hot. Who is it now? Are you Hello kidding me? In there. Is oh, there anyone in there? My goodness me. Hold up. One Constable. My door has a huge dent. Whatever brings you here. Blackbird Joy. Someone seems to have bashed your front door in, Mom. It's all right. Terrible, isn't it? I forgot my key and I had to sort of bash my way in. You don't believe I've that. I've had reports, Mom. All sorts of people come into your door. Amazing, oh, isn't boy. it? So many people get lost these days. Baby cries. They keep oh. asking me for directions. It's another You're not selling... Illicit substances, are you? Well, you'll know. You mean aside from Blackberry Joy? To the constabulary? Oh. Are you... Sally Boyle? Where's mm -hmm. your feet gone, my dude? Oh, <laughs> Just realised that. stupid of me. I'm so sorry to have been a bother. I, I, I know a terribly good joiner. I'll send him round. Fix that door up for you. Hey. No need, Constable. But you're very sweet. I'll just, yeah. uh... I'll be on my way, Mum. All right, man. Mom? Mom? What kind of accent's that? Freaking dingus. Anyway, we need that filtered water. Pronto. Give me that good stuff. nappies. Yeah. I better make some more. We can literally Where craft them. Where did I put that cloth and tape? Okay, good question. Uh, just over here. Some cloth scrap. And that's a nappy right there. Take some duct tape as well. So I'd imagine that's how we craft them. Let's go ahead and change the nappy then. Hopefully this isn't too graphic. Because you know what babies are like. Gwen, let us do this. Okay, nice and easy. girl. Right. Time to get clean. Sure. Like a little changing post as well. Thank goodness Sally looks up, you know? And there we go. All good. Wrapped up like a little caterpillar right there. Oh, you can't be serious. Are you kidding me? Sally's life is insane right now, you know? Like, everything is going on at once. It's crazy. I close as many doors as I can. Who the freak is at the door now? Hello, Miss Boyle. Oh, my gosh. Just wondering if you were uh, planning to, to, to drop the, the, um, the, the, the old neighborhood. Where's your feet, bro? Soon. Again? We all miss you. Don't okay. worry, I'm fine. I'm just in the middle of, um, cooking. Sure. You know? I'll get on the blower and let everyone know. Soon right. as it's ready. Promise. And there you go. And... Bye, then. Oh. Rude. She's probably hungry by now. Dude, this is so I demanding right now. I should have fed her before I started the reaction. Maybe so, but I don't know what else to do. Let me just swipe the card. That seals the door. Okay, I want to do that. So we need to get some milk from the fridge. Like, what am I playing right now, Sims? Right, just here. That's a lot of smashed milk. What? No, 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 no. No, they can't all be broken. What? No, this was enough milk for a month. How did that happen? Look it. The fridge. No, I better go cut her down. I can't think when she's crying like that. Goodness, this lifestyle there, man. Baby. This is nuts. Everything's gonna be okay. Mummy promises. Hmm. Thing is, Mummy doesn't know how she's gonna feed you. Did you know that? And if she doesn't figure it out, I got a graphic. baby is gonna starve to death. <clears throat> Is Sally. mummy the worst mummy ever? Yes, she is. Yes, she is. I see that baby's face agreeing Lionel. right now. Wait. Lionel might have tinned milk. Lionel? He has okay. a bit of everything. All right, well, there's our man. So, hint, welcome to motherhood. At certain points in Sally's story, you will need to get back home and feed Gwen. Don't delay or an increasingly heavy burden will be placed upon you as you worry more and more about her. She's a good mother then. Okay, I see. No Listen, neglect. Darling. Mummy's gonna go and see Lionel. Mm -hmm, bro. Try not to cry too much till Mummy comes back. Okay. Okay. Please. I don't think that's gonna work. Mummy will be back with supper as soon as she possibly can. Is that right, Gwen? Dad. 
Welcome back. <laughs> so following on from the objective that we now have to do, we've got to go over to someone called Lionel and figure out how we're going to get this tinned milk thing under control. Uh, we did pick up a note, so... I need to soundproof this building a little bit, jeez. So we did also get this letter. Pussycat, mind if I stop by for a cup of tea? I miss you so, love, kitten. Hmm. Kind of suspect, right? Yeah, not really. All right, let's do this though. Swipe our card. We should probably do a little bit of looting. So our own desk is locked and we don't have access to it. That's always a strange problem, I'm gonna be honest. Let's search all this stuff though, man. We need to see what bits we got lying around. Some coarse linen, some bleach as well. Times four, coffee beans, uh, nothing in there. And we have the better chemistry set. Black powder formula and Dexipan. Thanks. Let's take a seat at this thing so we can craft a nappy. I, 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 we then have all of these different chemicals we can craft. Considering the fact we don't actually have any of the materials, we're gonna go ahead and leave that one there. Uh, we'll keep searching this stuff though. I mean, we may have the materials real soon, you know? Let me just check one more time. I got a load of stuff right there. Yep, I can only make a nappy still. Great. I feel so bare bones all over again though, you know? Like, day one, starting out fresh, it's- Why is with this foot crisis, by the way? Constable Hogworth? Lovely day for it. Uh, all right. What? What? Bro. We're gonna move on, very swiftly. You know what, at the same time, it feels good to have a brand new fresh start. Like, we learn a lot about the story of Arthur and Percival, and there's so much left unanswered. Like, does Arthur ever actually get to Percival, that sort of thing? You don't know. And I'm extremely curious to find out. I don't know if we're ever gonna, guys. I don't know if there'll be like DLC for this thing where maybe we can actually explore once we're out. These are all just ideas. But for now, let's just focus on Sally's story and see what else is popping up here. I can't run again. I gotta remember that. All these perks we once had, they're all completely- uh -huh. Bro, don't point, Constable Turner. That's kind of rude. I'm chill, completely calm. The freak is this place here? I'm just walking right now. Can you not judge me? Go ahead, get some of this right here. Get that Gilead. Nice. Yeah, we're gonna have to collect everything all over again and be very careful with how we use our sprinting. That's gonna be like a first upgrade I think I get. That helps us move around the place a lot quicker. In fact, hold up, I got nine skill points right here. So with nine skill points, I'm gonna buy the smooth talk to begin with and then I think we can sprint now quietly. And then the next one in line is the one where we can get people ignoring our habits, so perfect. Still can't sprint though. You see, it says sprint quietly. Oh, I'm doing nothing. Now, you're on the right side of the line. Yeah, and the back of my hand's about to be on the right side of your cheek. <laughs> I gotta stop with that stuff, man. They're breaking the buildings here. Ooh. I don't know if that's wise, though. You know, if you go on the outskirts, you can never get back in. So with that knowledge, maybe we've got to go a different direction. So down here and then up there. Okay, let's follow this one. Bro, how many old ladies are there in this place? Hold on, one, two, three, four. What? About ten of the same exact person. You can take your joy. Can't run. I can't run. Oh boy! Ooh. Don't do it! Don't do it! Is he gonna do it? No. Okay, back on track. So, I'm gonna get some more of the Gilead just back here. We've gotta keep doing this again. Check the rubbish bin. Uh, leather scraps. You know what? We will take that. Hmm. The freak is this place in here? Is this, uh, is this like a new place? Hold up. Miss Boyle? Here. Yeah. Hi. Goodbye to all that. I mean, I see your face and I recognize it. Hold up. Look, if you're still mad about that incident with the, um, Cozy. So this is a different person? Oh, I think? no. I need your assistance. Okay. It's sort of private. I've heard there's a fake pill that makes you look like there. you've had joy. Silly rumors. I sort of need one. Why would you want to go off your joy? Mm. It's for Beatrice. Well, it's sort of for me. You're going to slip it to her? It's just... If you're tired of her, break things off like a man. No. Hold up. I love her. It's just... Well... Ever since we started seeing each other, okay, she says she loves me. Oh, but she loves everything. That's true. Me. Long walks, sunsets, and rainbows, of course. Is it the joy she loves, Simon or him says, actually? Big wristwatches on a man, wrapping paper, dandelions. Okay, Bruh. a good night's sleep. Goodness, uh, ribbons. Wow. I have to know if it's real. Sure, she'd be a downer. Even if it's temporary. Mm. The moment she tells me the truth, I'll give her a real joy. Okay. Promise. Are you Kinda sure you that? want the truth? You used mm. to be very interested in my mojo recipe. A dab a day keeps the doctors away, remember? No. Yes. I guess I do, though. I remember. That would be handy. All right. That's the potential, then. So give sunshine. Do I have any? I, I must just have one on my person, I guess. 
Like, I'm just gonna All do right. it out of the way. The recipe? Let's find out. I'll give it to you tomorrow after uh, I see Beatrice. He's really upset. So what, meet Benedict in 24 hours right here? And you better be back! Now, as for this memory up here, I don't know what that's showing. Hold on, let me just run around here. What is this? It's just a male and a female simply, like a love park or something. All right, so the memory, beastly. All right, let's see how this relates to, I guess, something. These are a totally new set of flashbacks, though, you know? Oh, what's wrong, dear? Girls are so beastly. And they tell such vile lies. Oh. How did you provoke them? How did I? <laughs> you act superior and keep to yourself when because you're Because not... I don't sit around with them smoking and gossiping about boys and teachers. Okay. You spend all your time with the boys in Rocket Club. They'll probably think you're trying to poach their boyfriends. Mm. They don't even have boyfriends. Sally, dear, boys aren't your real friends. They're just after one thing. If, if you don't wow, have okay. girlfriends, you won't have any friends at all. So she was a tomboy. I guess that explains like the uh, scientific background as well. Let's seal up the gate. Let's go ahead then and just go this way. Don't cry over tin milk. Coast looks clear. Let's get a little bit of a sprint on right now. Oh, okay. Gonna have to keep going. Now, is this place slightly different? I'm seeing some strange new things here and there, like there's a workbench. Maybe we gotta go investigate that place in due time. I can sprint a little bit more. Don't be looking right there, big fella. I think it's just in Please here. Please have tin milk, Lionel. Oh, that? I gotta go ahead and lock this thing. Right, here you go. Let's talk. Uh, get up. I'm about to. Oh. Harder on yourself. Whoa. <gasps> that scared the crap out of me. Look at his face. Now you're on the right side Ooh. of the law. Come on, Lionel, give me the good boy news. Or. I'm afraid I haven't got anything new or fashionable for a monk girl like yourself. Is that like the yourself. same guy? Surely not, man. Everything I've got is as old as me. <laughs> Even the milk? Oh, Lionel. Uh. You've never felt old to me. I need some tin milk for something I'm brewing. Oh, well, uh... The, 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 the trade from over the bridge, well... All, all we seem to have at the moment is a few tins of leftovers from the war and... Not many. They're practically collector's items. Pricey. Great. Oh, I'm a bit short on funds at the moment. Is there anything we could trade? Not unless you're willing to go over to the garden district. <laughs> <sighs> We're going to have to, aren't we? A girl like you? Some of the wastrels out there. there, there there's rumours of cannibals, devil worshippers, cute jumpers. It's sweet that you're looking okay. out for me. <laughs> well, <laughs> some time ago, Uncle Jack made a record album. Uncle Babe. Jack Sings. And I got a collector who's dying to have it. Mm. Now, I know there's a bunch of Uncle Jack fans who have a sort of compound on eel pie. If anyone's got the album, it's them. So that's where we're headed, right? Bring me that, and I'll give you all the tin milk I have. Ooh. All right. I'll see what I can find. Now, we better find it. It's not a case of seeing what we can find. We have to do this right. Ooh. The freight's the door locked. I think I did, actually, didn't I? You are petite. You're not terrific at fighting or at surviving fights, but you don't have to avoid confrontations because you are a genius scientist. Your powerful experimental drugs make you a match for any opponent. Unfortunately, you are rubbish at anything mechanical, including sewing it. You will need to buy your supplies and weapons from shopkeepers and your outfits from Mrs. Pankhurst. Fortunately, your old boss, Stuart the chemist, will pay a lot of money for your concoctions. So Uncle get brewing Jack for records. everybody. Hmm. Jesus Christ. So where are we headed, man? Gwen's life is hanging on Uncle Jack records. Sounds Not like that Lionel it. knows that. Thank mm. God. Now, are there any traps or hatches, you know? I better go home and get my garden district dry. Oh, crap. Can't walk around there in the latest Davy Hackney. Sure, I feel you. It gets I feel so you. resentful. So we gotta go, I guess, back. <laughs> Can you not? Okay, so it says that the shelter right here. Now, if this could be a track access hatch, that would definitely be worth getting nice and soon. So I'll check around this thing, see if we can find maybe a way in, or just, I guess, see exactly what it is. Because if we've got to run everywhere around this place, it's going to take a very, very long time, and that's no good. Wait, 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 wait. Down a breach. Ooh. All right, so we can maybe use these things? We yes! can. Thank goodness for that. Ooh, this will save a lot of time, I'm telling you. But was this before Arthur was down here or not? Hmm, this is weird seeing this all again, you know? Boffins go this way, apparently. Wow. Another memory. Different. I'm gonna take it. Right next to a chemistry set as well. That's gonna be a big clue. Uh, okay, how different? I'm feeling... Sally Boyle! What a Freak. lovely bunch of non-suches. From your mum's garden, but we, she's like... crying. Can you make me different? I wanna be different. But you are different. Like a she witch means thing? like everyone else. I'm supposed to care about dresses and dances, and all I can think about are rockets and chemicals. Can you give me something to make me silly? Wow. For a couple of hours, I dare say. Shush. So it drilled you it into my head. You don't have to care about dresses and dances. 
You just have to pretend to. Your mother told you to always tell the truth, didn't she? The lies they tell children. But you ladies don't care about dresses, do you? But I love dresses. Keep to your chemicals for later. Okay. Later? Later when? Things change. What do you mean? What? Do you know something? Where did you all go? What the freak is going on? What the heck? What's that crap? We got some like voodoo crap in here? Hold up, this is getting weird. So the track access hatch is still open. Are they all linked up around? Yeah, the whole place is just completely powered up. Uh, we've got a book here, but though we can't read it. I don't read anyway, I don't care. Maybe what we can do for now then is just simply get back over. We can travel to unknown hatches. That's very interesting. Should we go to this one here? It's kind of far away, but... I'm kind of fascinated. Status effects continue to increase or decrease your rest level, or while you rest. I'm gonna try this one. Skip the scene again. I mean, I don't know where the freak I'm headed, but I'm interested. Ugh. Okay. What My the heck? My nose needs a bath. What the heck are you talking about? We can literally travel from access hatch to access hatch really, really quickly. That's gonna save a tremendous amount of time as well. That's really, really convenient. So once we do have access to this track catch, guys, I'm starting to feel like maybe we don't need to use it just yet. There's a few more things that we need to get in place at least before, so I'm gonna travel back, I think. Okay, so I'm definitely gonna do the optional quest of going back and getting our district kit. If we're dressed how we are, I suppose it's gonna be bad, though the baby meter is going very, very low. So my plan is gonna be to actually head over toward the house, get our gear, and then we're gonna head straight back out. And we are finally back, thank goodness. Okay, close the door, we'll go ahead. We can't lock it, okay. But I definitely wanna go ahead and get my, uh, I guess the suit thing that I need. So wait, just in here. There it is, the garden district kit. Thank goodness for that. Maybe I should check on Gwen. I don't know if it's actually gonna help, but this seems really bad. Yeah, I can't do nothing. Gwen, please be quiet. One minute, 37 seconds later. All right guys, I kinda just went for it. Oh my God, there are so many. Come on, get in, get in! Woo! Bro, I was clenching the cheek so much. Oh. That was too close, never again. Now my health is looking very, very low, so I'm gonna have to get some crafting done. Okay, I've actually got a medicated balm, so we're gonna definitely use that one. Dang, that was way too close, and these meters are basically done. Okay, healing balm, we'll make at least one of them. Okay, now we're gonna use the track access hatch, and I think it's in the direction I need. Uh, let me just double check. That looks roughly in the right direction, okay? I had a look on the map. I think I this, this is where Chris goes to. Uh, yeah? Uh, okay? I am so glad Foggy Jack oh. doesn't live down there. Gosh. Look. I'm trespassing straight up. Got a cricket bat. And I will use it. Oh, man. Uh, requires rap. So I can't even use it. Sing it, bro. I'm sad. Let's maybe there's another way around this thing. And quickly establishing that there is no other way. Great. I've forgotten how... Right. Yeah. <laughs> had to take it, guys. My water was dwindling low. Now, the baby's, like, uh, dummy meter is completely gone, or pacifier meter. I don't really know what that means. Like, I don't know what to prioritize. I'm getting a little bit confused. Like, I gotta get from here right the way to there. It's, that's crazy. Like, I gotta walk that whole distance. It's gonna take me such a long time. Uh, okay, guys, I'm gonna do a little bit of cutting for this because this is gonna take a very, very long time to even get started with this one. So let's go ahead and do this. Oh my God, what is this, like granny meeting? <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? Uh, yeah, this place is getting weird. Hint, Gwen needs you. The burden of motherhood weighs on you more and more heavily. Don't you think you should drop everything? That's what I've been trying to do. So now I gotta go back. That's just fantastic, isn't it? Oh boy, and I've also just became a downer. Okay, let me take a seat. I've been... So, I can't... What can I do? This kind of sucks. I don't know what to do. I gotta play it real carefully. Bobby's there. If I take a seat... Look! I... I can't do anything. This kind of sucks. Ah, uh, well, I'm just gonna have to run, okay? This sucks. Oh my gosh. Now, am I going... Where, where the freak am I going? I'm so confused, man. Let me go into here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my god. Scared the crap out of me, so they can't come through this way. Woo! That was close, man, but I'm good. So, are they... They're still peeved off. Right, I'm gonna close that. Okay, use this quickly. Okay, and seal it up. Oh boy. I should be okay. Should be. All right, lock the back door. They can't get in right now. There, there, little Gwen. Uh, wait, how do I, how do I comfort her? It says about the burden of something. I'm right here. I, oh, is it this here? Does that do it? Maybe? I, I have no idea. It's still red, like the meter of, uh, I guess, trying to look after Gwen. 
What the heck is going on? I'm so confused. I mean, it stopped a crime, but it's done nothing to uh, get rid of the little burden thing. I'm so confused so far with Sally's thing. We're going to figure this out, though, I guess. Oh. Don't you even uh, think about coming back. Bro, one of your bobbies has passed out and smashed his face so hard off the floor he's refusing to get up. He's dead, in fact. And you're just going to leave his body there. Okay, so I'm going to try and get this thing moving a little bit quicker. The little pacifier meter things in the corner, I don't understand. I would have thought that being with Gwen for a little while, spinning the little, uh, I can't remember what it's called, the musical thing, would have maybe cheered her up and made us feel a bit better. Nope. But I guess not. So, uh, yeah, I have no idea. So is this where we got to go? You know, this little access gate thing here? I guess it would appear so. This is going back to Maiden Home. No one actually on the stand? We can go the other side way, though. So St. George is home. It's locked up. What about this thing here? Okay, we can simply hack it. Or oh, it's been hacked even to unlock it. So someone else maybe made it back. I gotta take a freaking Bloody joy. Revolvers. Oh, man. I've got a sunshine somewhere, haven't sure. I? Uh, a girl like you. I didn't give it to the guy, did I? That would be so frustrating if I did. Um, yeah. I gave my sunshine away. <laughs> a girl like you. Let's see what this memory's all about then, you know? Oh, boy. This is not good so far. I keep messing up. I don't care how smart you are. You have to make them feel smart if you want them to like you. Okay. But they're also dull. They can't see past the river. Every man, even the most boring, has something fascinating in him. You just have to winkle it out of him. And I'd rather live in a hut in the woods on roots and berries. Oh, I don't wow. know what becomes of a girl like you. I swear to God, I don't. So she wanted her to live like this normal lifestyle. I just pulled out a freaking head. Okay, so I'm going to have to pop a joy for now, guys. I got rid of my last sunshine pill. All right, going to see things as false as they are. <sighs> Let's just go through this thing. Dizzy. Mm, but alive. If we go through this thing and make it out the other side. And there you go. All right, now we get a nice look at the land. Very wrong, though. Let's go on through. Again, I don't think no one's manning it. Those are the, uh, like, police detector things. Uh, okay, authorized personnel was wet. Electronic insulation garb. Wait, is that the wrong... Dude, I'm so confused. How do we... I thought we had to go... I, I don't get it. Are we going the wrong way? I think I am right now. Okay, look, I'm gonna run the other way, and I can't be dealing with confrontation, so I'm gonna run around the outside of this entire village. Let's just get this done. Okay, Megiddo Bridge. I gotta wait this one out, guys. I'm gonna be a freaking downer. Having one of my episodes, so yeah, we're gonna wait underneath this thing and I'll be right back. Let's do this, man. Okay, so what does that one say? Area under renovation? Yeah, okay, about being beautified? Yeah. I know it's a load of crap. Press the button, so through. One we of go. these days, Gwen, I'm gonna teach you all about chemical interactions. Mm. They're so much more reliable than boys. Something must have happened then. Sally uses an atomizer to spray chemicals at enemies. You can craft hallucinics in the chemical section of the crafting menu. And I think that goes on because I think it said something about Sally's takedown stuff being a little bit weaker. So she's more focused, I suppose, on the chemical stuff. And uh, so they had fires here. Either that or they destroyed the place. So we gotta head in that direction. Back in Lud's home. I think again I'm gonna run in the outskirts. It's kind of weird being back, you know? Seeing all this stuff all over again, it's like re-experiencing the madness what we once had with Arthur. I take a Rowan Berry. I guess because of that as well, we can kind of speed up through some sections of this, which is nice because, as said before, we have seen these types of lands. And saying that, a load of Rosa Gillian. Always goes well with my house looking a bit dwindly. Now, are the, uh, I can't remember what they call them. They're something boys, I think. Are they patrolling the lands? Don't think so. Or it may only be in the evening, so we've got that to, uh, I guess, ref- I bet those ah. clothes keep you Oh! I'm wearing my wrong clothes. I picked up my garbs though, where are they? Okay, the torn suit, throw it on. All right, now let me see how they respond. There you go, change that personality. I literally whipped my dress off, threw it back on in front of them. They don't care. As long as I look a mess, they're happy. Oh, we're back, wait. Why am I hearing a lullaby, hold up. Is that inside here? That's kind of trippy. I'm just saying. All right, we've got head boys littering the place, so I'm going to avoid that for now. But that's where Ollie resides, so that's really interesting. Let's keep moving through anyway. The Avon Puppet Theater. Loads of pictures of us. It's kind of strange, isn't it? Maybe we'll check that one out in due time. Enter the Avon Puppet Theater. I mean, I can't. Let's think about Peachy's final mission. Maybe we'll check that one out in due time. Okay, the phone's ringing. Hold up. Is it going to be like the fox, like, fired on the chicken or something? Mr. Kite. Close enough. The rabbit got into the garden. Yep. The rabbit got into the garden. Sounds okay, like Uncle Jack. This is where we needed to be, right? Uh, let me go ahead and take that Gilead. There's quite a few around here. Another one. Because we are going to be, I think, stealing stuff from them, it said. If I got some health stuff, that's going to be good. All right. Uh, Uncle Jack live in person. Guys, you're being way too hopeful. He ain't about to come down to a Hello. downerfield place. Are you a friend of Uncle Jack? Of course. Who isn't? Yeah, I just want the this record. Part. I mean, yes, of course. Some people seem to think that because we're out here in the garden district... We have to abandon all pretense of civilization. 95%, right? We can't take right? joy. 
But that doesn't mean we can't see the world the way Uncle Jack does, right? Okay. It's just a question of concentration. Oh, yes. In fact, Uncle Jack has heard Can of Can I tell him a load of lies? He's heard of they us. They all turn around. That's creepy as free. serious. That Is guy there, though, doing the camera. on the TV? Oh, but we never get the new programs out Wait. here. What did he say? How do you know? Why don't you ask him? He's coming to visit. He wants to do a live broadcast from here. And they just believe it, straight He's up. He's coming here? But the place is a mess. It's getting tidy. We'll have to clean up. Come on. Ah! Thank goodness for that. Okay, Jack's so find the two rare records for Lionel. That's the spirit. Now, you know what I'm going to do? Let's show Uncle Jack okay? just how much right. we love him. As I back up slowly. Irrelevant, I don't care. Okay, I'm saving my game just outside here if we mess up. So, he's gone in. Now, I gotta find some records. If I go in there, will I be trespassing, maybe? I am. So back out. Ooh, how am I gonna get through to this then? This is difficult. Let's do a little bit of scouting. Could be up the stairs and over there, maybe. Hmm, Simon says enjoy yourself. If I go up there, am I again gonna be trespassing? Let me see. Okay, I'm not at the moment. So, I think anyone's seen? It's locked. Can I craft a lockpick? I can. But people are gonna see! How do I do this? I'm gonna do it simply by picking the freaking lock. I am waiting. All right, so we've done that one. All right, this guy's coming up, so I gotta go away. Don't look obvious at all. all right, he's going down the stairs. I'll open the door. It's definitely gonna be over there, right? It's on the low. Close that. Wait, let me lock it. Stay outside. Okay, she's gonna bust the door down, so let me go this way here. This two. I've got that one. All right, I'll take the cross scrap as well. Take that. Uh, metal bits times two. Let's go. This is a chest here. I'm gonna also lock pick this one. I've got one out of two, and I think our heat is fairly low. I know I'm trespassing, so suffering in the canteen. Let her go out, and then I'm gonna go straight back over. Keep it on the low. Ooh, she didn't see nothing. Okay, so if I'm... There's a guy right there, though. You gotta move, bro. You gotta move. Right, he's going. Okay, so we'll go ahead and unlock this one. Now open it, and just walk out nice and casually. Nothing to be seen here. Okay, so there's no one in this place here. The second one is just within this reach. You know what, I'm gonna heal up ahead of time just to be safe. Okay, see where she goes? Study her patrol pattern. Okay, so she's sweeping there. Now if I go in and crouch, it'll be quiet. Is it over there? It's right there. Maybe I can just take this thing. Take it. Now I gotta get back out. Whoa! Oh man, okay. They are looking at me a bit gone out. So if I move, I did that without getting caught. Dang! Woo-wee! All right, guys, now I'm gonna make a run back. I wonder make some sort of automatic baby feeder for me. That would be very, Then I wouldn't have very to run back home nice. as often to feed Gwen. Yeah, I like the idea Sounds of that one. Sounds a bit hard-hearted, doesn't it, Gwen? But Mummy's trying to save our lives. We gotta do it, you know? It's a compromise. It sounds bad on the surface, but deep down, why are we doing it? To keep Gwen alive. Not bad, not bad. Fairly successful, if I don't say so myself. Now, the last thing we're going to do then, guys, is head back over, and I'm just going to give the guy the goods, so let's go ahead and do that. Now, I will say one thing about these sort of districts, okay? You can just sprint and sprint and sprint, because there are so many outlandish, like, outback areas. You don't even need to worry half the time. So it does make traversing a lot more convenient, especially when you don't have the perk when you can't run, because uh, if someone sees you, they get a bit triggered. So, yeah, that's what I love about these places, getting to and from nice and fast. Talking of nice and fast, watch this jump cut. Okay, we're going to jump cut to here. We've got another memory, Brave. That's four memories in one video. What? Why did you bring us here? I Holy wanted you crap. all to see what bravery looks like. We have to take them home. At least they try to destroy the birth records. At least they try. Whoa, man. The rest of the town hanged them on this bridge. Are they just going to leave those people hanging there till they rot? It's medieval. Oh, I wish I was half as brave as Tommy Cramner and the Lushfords. Oh, my God. Hello. What? Oh, wait. Let's have a look at you, shall we? Oh, hold up. Let me change my gear. Hold up, Doc. Nice and clean. <laughs> Whoa! Wait, there's someone actually there, look! Tip-top shape, aren't you? You were so pleased you survived the garden district. What the freak? Toodaloo. Oh! This, okay, I'm liking the way Sally's story goes. It's very, very unique with these little twists and turns. Okay, now watch this jump cut. And so we're back! How does he do oh, it? Day, How is. does he do it, Sally man? Sally Boyle! So we're done! I hope you find the Uncle Jack record. Me borer has been pestering me. Your borer? I have indeed. I'll give that to you, Bor. Trillo, <laughs> milk you shall have. Let's do it, Lionel. You're sort of handy, aren't you? She wants to make a milk well, dispenser. Well, we do like to tinker. You'd be amazed to think of some of these things when they come into the shop. Can't sell them if I can't fix them. Okay. I have some designs for some apparatuses. Some sort of uh, water feeder. Sure. For, for birds. Yep. Oh heavens no! I can't stand the crows. 
It's for my flowers. Mustn't over water, but I keep forgetting to water it all. <laughs> mm, sure. Oh, of course. Yeah, it's the joy, because uh, we well, take it, by the way, Let me line see up. what i got in the back there. I, I, I bet I can find all the pieces sooner or later. Okay. They, they, they never show up right away, but they always show up sooner or later. Uh, check back in a bit. Got it. Okay, we've got our tin milk, so come back in three days. Okay, so the last thing that we're going to do, guys, is go ahead and make some baby milk. So first off, we're going to fill the water. I can also use this, okay, for myself too. So let that thing do its thing, I guess. And it looks like that's as good as it's going to be. Take the pure water. Now, if we go into the crafting menu, I think now, right there, we make the baby milk. Good stuff. <sighs> You know what? Gwen's got something to eat at least. He has. I'm gonna go ahead and pre-filter another one. Very, very handy piece of equipment right there. Hey, hey Gwen! Go, finally back! Oh hey, man! Luke. What an you adventure we went for this one, you know? What to do to get this for you? Yeah. Well, I'll never tell you, frankly. Fair point. Fair point. <laughs> She's all happy. Woo! We did that good work. That's all I'm saying. What a relief. You can now go back to your adventures. Who's at the bloody door now? Uh, probably a dingus. Okay, guys, I know someone's at the door, but I'm gonna leave it here. A good spot and a good cliffhanger, so you guys wanna see the next part even sooner. We have to check back in that park thing to see what that guy's got going on because we gave him the sunshine pill. I guess find out the results. And then the baby feeder thing come back in three days. And there's also these other quests appearing around where it involves Arthur. So there may be some lore involving Arthur a little bit more. We do have quite a few things we've got to look forward to, but for this one, we are gonna leave it here. And I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, why not drop me that like rating? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more? videos just like this one right here. So thank you so much for watching this video guys. I of course hope you did enjoy and I will of course see you on the next one. <laughs>